It's only going to happen one time. You're only going to get one opportunity to do that, and that's something that no one can take away from you for a lifetime. 15,000 people will pack the Yum Center for Friday's memorial. Thousands more will watch on at the Belvedere. It's also been one of the most honorable things to be involved in. You're going to float like a butterfly and sting like a bee. The Louisville Lip left his mark on the world. Now the world is turning to his hometown to pay tribute. We try to make every accommodation for everybody, make it easy on all of us. In his 29 years in law enforcement, Major Kelly Jones has never covered any event this big. There's a certain amount of pride and honor in it. As I said earlier, when we walk away from this detail tomorrow, you can say that as an employee of city government, you had a hand in giving a send off to one of Louisville's greatest. Jones is the commander of LMPD Special Operations Division. Well, we have a lot of protocol. Uh, some individuals uh, require Secret Service level protection. Some folks just need a little boost from LMPD and, and how do we get around town? Local, state, and federal agencies, including the Secret Service, will help with security. It does provide a special challenge, and you know, just different folks rise to different levels of needs. And uh, sometimes the uh, the uh, folks in Washington help us to understand what certain folks need. About 500 Metro officers will work during Friday's funeral procession and memorial. Visitors are encouraged to have a plan before heading to the events. It's really one of those things where we need folks to get themselves educated before they get here so that the process is not complicated. And whether you're heading to the KFC Yum Center for Ali's memorial or plan to line the procession route, his funeral procession, plan to line the route his funeral procession will take, LMPD is asking everyone to plan on arriving early. Reporting live, Emily Maha, WLKY News.